Wilhelm Reich's relationship with Sigmund Freud is a topic of much debate and speculation in the field of psychology. Reich was a prominent figure in the psychoanalytic movement, and his association with Freud has been a subject of interest for many scholars and researchers. Reich's connection to Freud began in the early 1920s when he met the renowned psychoanalyst and became his student. He was later appointed as an assistant in Freud's clinical practice, where he gained valuable experience and knowledge in the field of psychoanalysis. In 1920, Reich was offered membership in the Vienna Psychoanalytic Association, a prestigious honor that solidified his place in the psychoanalytic community. This recognition also marked the beginning of his professional relationship with Freud and his colleagues. Despite being a student and assistant to Freud, Reich's views and theories began to diverge from traditional psychoanalytic principles. This led to a gradual shift in his approach to psychology and eventually to a parting of ways with Freud and the psychoanalytic movement. While Reich's association with Freud was significant in shaping his early career and professional development, it ultimately led to a divergence in their perspectives and a subsequent separation. This pivotal moment marked the beginning of Reich's independent exploration of psychoanalysis and the development of his own unique theories and methodologies.